let us rejoice and be glad and give him glory rejoice be glad give him glory why he says for the day of the wedding of the lamb has come and his bride has made herself ready he gives the real reason why there's historic celebration historic jubilation historic felicitation in the kingdom of god verse 7 he says that long awaited day has come and the bride is ready Amen. you see now it's all about you the real reason really why they are celebrating is that when the day arrives they fear the lord might be put to shame but when they check the bride is ready arrived and ready how do they know that the church in helsinki in malmo in stockholm sweden the church in christ church in auckland new zealand the church in melbourne australia in sydney the church in nairobi how do they know that the church is ready so they can celebrate does the church have to write something on the back saying ready oh yes when they look at the church look at this now they see that she's wearing finest linen bright and clean hallelujah that finest linen is righteousness when you now look and you see the stairs of the lord he's announcing the dispensation of the garment is here hallelujah he's saying the dispensation of the garment has arrived are you wearing your garment he's saying you are the generation of the garment you are the church of the garment. And then he says, that finest linen is righteousness. That is what is lacking most. What an awesome conversation today. That the Lord is saying, that behold, the hour for righteousness. Behold, the hour for holiness. Why are your pastors not preparing the garment? Why? Because if they were preparing the garment, I would look and see in your lifestyle. This is a tragedy, beloved people. He said, finest linen, bright and clean was given the church to wear. Given, excuse me, given to her. Did you hear that she purchased? No. Given. God's garment. The garment of the Lord. Do you remember the measuring rod? Given. Hey. Why is the church using another garment? Meaning, there is only one garment of the Lord. Given. Whatever the denomination, as long as you are born again, receive Jesus, given unto you. Same garment, same standard, same benchmark, same yardstick. The garment actually belongs to the Lord. 